Hi, my name's Carl and I am a senior designer at LEGO. Hi, I'm Anthony Palomaro and I am the lead graphic designer on LEGO Super Mario. So today we'd like to show you the LEGO Super Mario 64 question mark block. When you unfold this set, you reveal a beautiful micro display of Peach's Castle and three iconic levels, Cool Cool Mountain, Lethal Lava Land, and Babam Battlefield. This product was a joint effort between me and Pablo, another one of our senior designers at LEGO. Together we explored all kinds of different functions for how the cube would slide open or flip over, and the one that we decided on is this sort of flip over and unfold function. And we just think it's so cool to have an entire world pop open. So we work very closely with Nintendo, and during that process we came up with this idea of having a micro scale version of Mario's world, and then having that be inside of a question mark block. Hi, I'm Dara, and I'm a designer on LEGO Super Mario. And I'm Benjamin, I'm a senior digital play designer on LEGO Super Mario. I came along a little later in the process after Pablo and Carl had been working on the cube. So I started working on the mechanisms, trying to make them run smoothly and working on the structure of the cube, getting all that finalized. Even though it looks like a simple cube, it was deceptively difficult to design. I think it was probably one of the hardest challenges I've ever had as a Lego designer because we needed to have so much space freed up inside for all of the levels and the display part. So actually the structure is mostly system based and it uses a lot of side building and upside down building and basically bracing in every direction to make it strong. We made two new building elements. One is a two by two corner plate to make the corners of the box as smooth as possible. And then the other one is a new one by one by two down bracket, which is actually for helping the structure of the set and we think it'll also be a very useful element for fans to build with. My role in the project was first of all developing the digital play with a Lego Mario if you have one of those or a Lego Luigi but probably primarily for the rest of the designers in the team I was the very vocal Super Mario 64 fan who would always come with suggestions and corrections about everything that they were working on. So the way the digital experience works is that inside of Peach's castle on the sun carpet which is actually a scannable action brick that either Lego Mario or Lego Luigi can scan if you scan that brick, you start an Easter egg hunt where you're actually looking for 10 power stars hidden throughout the set. Lego Mario or Lego Luigi will keep track of how many stars you've collected. And these stars are actually referenced in the building instruction. So you have 10 hints that you have to hunt down in order to find these 10 hidden stars. But this being an Easter egg hunt, it's actually not quite easy to find all of them. I've actually made sure that some of them are a little bit tricky, so you have to solve the riddles in order to find the hidden stars. So after we had figured out you know, how much space was needed, we found out we still had a tiny little bit of space inside the cube to hide something else. So we have created a little hidden compartment and a pretty nice Easter egg that you can check out when you build a model. There's a couple more hidden Easter eggs in this set, but they're so secret, we're not actually allowed to talk about them on camera. I have two favorite parts of this set. I love Mr. Eye, because that element is an eyeball that we printed on for Mixels, so that I, another theme I love to work on. And then I love the whole flip over and unfold function. I just think it came out really, really cool. So this is a set built by Super Mario 64 fans for the Super Mario 64 fans. And we have hidden so many details that will remind you of the time when you first played Super Mario 64. If you like Lego. If you like Nintendo 64. If you like question mark blocks. If you like Super Mario 64. If you like mustaches. If you like pipes. If you like Mario. If you like Lakitu. Just go buy this set. Yeah. <laughs>